click on OK. Now take off this department. Take the region. Notice here the second scenario. In the first scenario, what I did is I just shown you how this going this formula is going to be react to the department and then category and item. Now here we have a department, here we have a region. So in the fixed LOD, this dimension is not you know, being mentioned so that it is getting displayed overall revenues of some sales. Overall revenues of sales. The total revenue of the sales is 8.9 million. So in case if you take any dimension that's not being mentioned, I mean declared in a fixed LOD, so it get display the window level sum sales. So 8.9 million is nothing but its overall sale. Say example, if I take the take sales under the text, you can see that 8.9 million is the total revenue we got. The same total revenue is assigned to the each and every region so I can start comparing total revenue with the central region in coming scenarios we can see that so just understand that the case one if we take the values mentioned in the fixed LOD it is going to be react in different way if you take you know other values won't did not mention in the fixed it react with total table values now so what if i there is a near very near difference i mean very similarity between the table level calculations and del body so i think guys we you know about table level calculations See, I can here all table level calculations always followed by window, right? We know that logic. And now, without writing any table level calculation, I can declare table level sales, say, example, sum sales. So if you use curly braces, it's going to be become table level calculation. So I'll prove that. Just click on OK. So here we have a table calculations. Take the department. See that you got 8.9 millions. Overall sales of table 8.9 millions. You get table level calculations. So the same formula can be written even using with window sum sum sales so calculation is valid. So just understand the difference between the table level calculations and curly braces. So just click on OK. Here we got window. Both are equal. Got it. So now coming forward to the next. How this include works? We just came to know that fixed works with fixing one specific dimension in the LOD expression. How this include is going to be working with us? Include. LOD. So again, I'm declaring here. We know already the syntax. We call it is scoping word. Scoping keyword include. And again, I'm declaring here dimension department. Then let's take the sales. Some sales. So the calculation is valid. Just click on OK. So 
So here we got include. Let's take it onto the column shelf and again take the department. So here we got 3.1 million. It's actual data of the, you no, know, this thing. Let's expand this. Again, we got 507, 507,000 dollars. So we got, so there is no change here in the data because whatever the expression that you define in the L would include, it includes all the dimensions. See, even if I take now the region here this is actual region sales got the same sales so you can take any dimension it applies that formula so include it helps us to include any of the dimension with this formula with this aggregate expression so it doesn't care whether it's a department or category or region sometimes it may be customer id or order id or state it include all the dimensions here got it so I'll, I'll let you know that where we can see the exact requirement of why if it is including all the dimensions we can straight away use sales why should we use the include right so I'll show you that difference where it exactly this include help us to get the calculations done. Now let's see exclude. Exclude department colon some sales calculation is valid so here we got it exclude everybody let's take it onto the column shelf for exclude we will get by default attribute I'll let you know that reason see here in exclude we mentioned department it never considered department it never gave us view level uh, view level of detail for department so for any any dimensions if you take for example if i take the category so it's it's working for category so i'm getting exact details if i mention the category in again in exclude Like you just giving command category so it gives again table level sale 8.9 million so now we just see the differences between different things right so I'll share this thing with you guys and we can't write if statements at the dimension declare that is not the part of syntax and then another another uh, doubt is say if you see here I created fixed I'll take another uh, example for fix for especially fix the end result if end result is giving a dimension then it will go under the dimensions if it is giving a measure it will come under the measures but include and exclude both never ever go under the dimension they are always under the measures but we have a flexibility that we can drag